Understanding the Contrarian Mindset Hello, everyone, welcome back to our channel. Today, we're diving into an interesting English phrase, being a contrarian. This phrase might sound complex at first, but don't worry, by the end of this video, you'll understand what it means and how to use it in your conversations. So, let's get started. At its core, being a contrarian refers to someone who opposes or rejects popular opinion, choosing to think in a way that is different from the majority. This doesn't just mean being disagreeable for the sake of it. Rather, a contrarian often has well-thought-out reasons for their differing viewpoints. They challenge the status quo, question widely accepted beliefs, and encourage us to think more deeply about why we hold our views. You might wonder why someone would choose to be a contrarian. Well, there are several benefits to this approach. First, it promotes critical thinking. By questioning common beliefs, contrarians encourage themselves and others to not just accept information at face value. This mindset fosters innovation and creativity, as it pushes people to explore new solutions and ideas that go against the grain. To better understand this concept, let's look at some examples. In the business world, a contrarian might invest in a company that everyone else is avoiding, believing that it has unacknowledged value. In science, a researcher might explore a theory that has been dismissed by the majority of the scientific community, leading to breakthrough discoveries. These examples show how contrarian thinking can lead to success in various fields by going against the mainstream. Being a contrarian doesn't mean you have to disagree with everything or everyone. Instead, it's about being open to questioning. Here's how you can embrace this mindset. Ask, why, frequently. Understand the reasons behind common beliefs. Do your research. Don't accept information as truth without evidence. Be open-minded. Be willing to change your opinion based on new, convincing evidence. We hope this video has shed some light on what it means to be a contrarian and why it can be a valuable perspective to have. Remember, the goal isn't to disagree for the sake of disagreement but to foster a more thoughtful, questioning approach to the world around us. Thank you for watching, and we hope you'll bring a bit of contrarian thinking into your own life. See you in our next video.